What's the issue? Sir, I'm supposed to be paired with someone else. The algorithm is never wrong. Now sit down and quit complaining. ID number B7294, ID number B7138. The algorithm has deemed you two a perfect match. You need to abide by the law by staying committed to each other. The country looks forward to your contribution in sustaining the population. Now sign this. Go on. Good. Problem solved. Carry on. This is not supposed to happen. I'm not supposed to be paired with you. You think I want to be paired with you? <laughs> you think I want to be paired with you? you stupid institute. You stupid. You are stupid. It is my duty to ensure that all departments meet its target and goal. Sorry. But it has been brought to my attention that a few departments are not doing their jobs properly and even have the audacity to be late. That makes me look like a very bad leader. Silence! Look, I don't have all day, so let's make this quick. Media Censorship Authority. Sir? Foreign content criticizing our politics has been reaching our citizens. We'll be proposing methods to strengthen our firewall. Good. Security. Sir, we have suppressed the protesters and the fatality rate has dropped significantly. Good. And did you hear the people sing? Yes, sir. Then do something about it. Sustainable population? There had better be a damn good reason why the birth rate is not hitting the target. Sir, the birth rate is gaining stability with the help of the pills, but we'll need more time to hit our objective. So, the pills are working, huh? There is a drop in problematic pairings being reported. However, we believe that the pills could be causing long-term side effects. We need to... Your job is to make sure that the birth rate hit the required KPI. Yes, sir, I understand, but you're missing Do the Do not make me repeat myself. And there's another enlisty escape. What happened, Ryan? Sir, if I may interrupt, we have caught him at the UK Customs we will bring him back for prosecution. Ryan, it seems that you can't handle your job by yourself. Therefore, I will assign Ken to take over some of your responsibilities. Sir, I can handle this on my own. My decision is final. Sweet now if I was paired with Liz. Ah, <sighs> maybe you should start growing up and stop whining like a little girl. This is our national duty, okay? <laughs> Evan Lim, what are you doing? You said we had a national duty, right? I, I was referring to us being paired together. What are you doing? Let's make a baby now. Stop it, stop being annoying. 
national duty. Putting your own words again. Since you don't want me around, let's keep it that way. Rule number one. Ayya. Sarah Tan, please, you are 25 years old. Can you stop being so childish? <laughs> Oi! Now, I won't be in your way and you won't be in mine. Hey, this is ridiculous. Oh. <sighs> Rule number two! You're splitting a bed too? Of course. No, I'm getting the bedroom. You can sleep on the sofa. Hey. Now, get out of my bedroom. Thank you. Hey, actually, I don't mind sharing the bed. Just stick to your side of the room. I said get out, Evan! Very unable to resolve dispute. Please report to the relations manager's It's your fault. My fault? How is it my fault? How is it not your fault? First, you got me into trouble for entering the restricted zone and now, this. Hey, nobody asked you to follow me to the restricted zone. You... Why do you even want to work for a stupid place like this? What's wrong with this place? I think whatever the government has implemented is best for our country. This job is very important to me, so just do me a favor. Don't screw this up for me, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our job here is to help all pairings get along well together. What you are experiencing now is normal behavior amongst unstable individuals when adapting to a new environment. Stick to your side of the apartment. Sarah Tan, please, you are 25 years old. Please stop being so childish. You've been spying on us all this time. How is this even ethical? It is essential for the algorithm to be fully aware of the status of all pairings. Please, take out your handbook. Turn to page 18, chapter 3. Communication is key. Evan, since you're a non-believer of this handbook, could you read the first paragraph? <clears throat> For a healthy cohabitation, there must be good communication. Learn to speak and listen and resolve all issues calmly. This, how does this even help? Uh, um, in order to strengthen the partnership, you'll have to do the following. Listen, do not talk at the same time. Take turns. This is stupid. So with this book, our relationship will suddenly be okay. Huh? Adexamine, you can take this to suppress your negative emotions caused by your partner. Emotion suppression pills. This is the magic solution for everything. I'm sure this session has helped you resolve your conflict. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Device like Tara. Hey, 
I'm not scared of the stupid device. I just don't like the fact that she's listening to our conversations 24-7. But you're not supposed to tamper with that. You know that, right? Yeah, yeah, I know. But think about it. We're always crawling every time we talk. This rate is a bye-bye to your job application. Wait, don't move. <laughs> I'm a genius. Sarah Tan, you suck. Say something mean to me. Evan Lim sucks more! <gasps> you won't! Uh, uh, Evan Lim is a smelly, obnoxious loser who who uh, always tries too hard! <laughs> and and um, he always likes to act like, ooh, I'm so tough, but actually deep down, he's a scary cat! I think enough, it works. He's scared of you, Tara! Laugh at him, laugh at him, Tara. <laughs> Even Tara laughing at you. Mm, shall we do something? Like a bonding activity? Daniel? Yeah? Do you like me? I love you. That's good. Uh, Kim, I think you're supposed to say, I love you too. <sighs> Sorry, I forgot. I love you too. Well done. Usage of love language. I don't know. I'm sorry I'm late. I had to settle some things with Evan. Something wrong with your newly assigned partner? It's nothing serious. Wow, this place looks amazing. The food here must probably be expensive. You can order whatever you want. Oh no, it's okay, thank you. Anyway, about my application. Someone's impatient. It's not that. It's just that you mentioned before you could help me, right? I might have some test information from some contacts I have. What's wrong? I'm 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 sorry. I think I should go. No, Sarah, please. I Sarah. Study so hard for what? Just give up. You really think you'll pass? Mm. Hey! I'm a lot smarter than you, okay? Hey, I'll tell you what. Why don't I sacrifice myself? If you pass, I let you kiss me. Right. Uh, who wants to kiss you? Congratulations. This is your third day together as partners. This is a reminder to consummate your pairing. She's tonight? 
you, you get it. I'm sure you heard Tara's announcement. I'll be here until I can verify that the both of you have consummated. <laughs> No, no, no. Come, 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 come. come here. No, 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 trust me, 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 trust me. Uh, okay, remember a few weeks ago, we had another this uh, class where we were taught to produce love hormones. Huh? Yeah, now we need to uh, recreate it without actually doing it. I don't know, I have all day to wait. Okay. Oh, okay. you, 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 you just, just follow my lead. Excuse me. No! Oh, massage me. Why don't you massage me? Gosh, shut up, we just do it. Hurry up. Yeah, yeah, you, you like that? Yeah, 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 you, you like that, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's try this. Are you sure it will work? Just get on top of me. You have completed your duty. I'll be taking my leave now. Get up, get up. Where did you even get that from? Weak. Positive, sir. Uh, there's a mismatch. The the physical doesn't match the, the electronic one. I, I, I'm not so sure. What... <laughs> Officer Ken, what brings you here? Just thought I'd introduce myself to you formally. I got a feeling that you didn't really like me the other day at the meeting. Could you uh, excuse us for a moment? You've got a nice office here. Anyway, I hope my appearance the other day didn't offend you. Not at all. Good. I'll come straight to the point then. I'll need all the Institute application documents to be handed over to me. I am in charge of the application process from now on. I don't need any help. I can handle the current batch of applicants. Why don't you step in at the next batch? Sorry, but this is under my charge now. Or should I get the chairman to tell you that again?
Thank you for your cooperation. Come in. I'm Officer Ken. This is regarding your application. Oh, I thought Officer Ryan was in charge. Officer Ryan is no longer in charge of the hiring process. I'll be taking over. Oh. I have your record here with me. And I must say it doesn't look very promising. Sarah Tan, ID number B7138. Complicated family background. Tuition debt. Struggling to pay rent. Average grades throughout your education. And in the Institute, you have been a troublemaker. Uh, this is just a misunderstanding. I can explain. I suggest you drop your application. What? No, no, you don't understand, sir. This job is really important to me. I need it. Well, there are plenty of good paying jobs out there. Maybe you can consider being a waitress? But sir, if you give me a chance, I can prove to you that I'm... Sarah, go home. Think about my suggestion. It will be better for you. It's not that bad. Plus, I honestly don't think I will ever need to go to a restaurant to eat. No, but I already promised I'll just treat you one day. What? Hey! Isn't it Sarah? Huh? What's she doing here? You're asking me? She's your partner. Sarah! Can you don't shout in my ear now? <clears throat> hey, Sarah! Hey, Daniel. What are you guys doing here? Avoiding you, obviously. <laughs> oh. I... I am gonna go. Okay. Okay, bye. So, what are you doing here, all alone, so late, huh, at this timing? Hello? You're crying, ah? Hey, were you crying, huh? Were you crying? Stop it. I was just trying to lighten up the mood. <laughs> I can't stop. Hey. Oh. Okay, I, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave now. Huh? Okay, okay. You know what? I, I leave. I leave. I leave. I leave. I leave. Wait. Don't leave. Oh. <laughs> and now you don't want me to leave. Am I not good enough? Huh? I just need this one thing and everything will fall into place. I tried really, really hard for this job application, but nothing that I do seems to be enough, you know? Is it too much to ask for a decent life? The new officer said I'm not competent enough and that I should give up on this job application. I think he saw the records of all the troubles we've been involved in and it's not even my fault. Uh, okay, okay. Oh, sh all right, all right. Sh 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 hey, don't, don't cry. Don't, don't, don't cry. Huh? Don't. I I'm sorry. I only wanted to be paired with someone rich because I'm just so sick and tired of this sad, poor life. It was so difficult waking up every day just worrying about money. I didn't know how much this could affect you, okay? It was selfish, I know. 
I will try my best to make life easier for you. I will start by fixing up the light bulbs. Sorry about your watch. Promise to make it up to you. Thank you.